Welcome back everyone. Today we're diving into an exciting face-off between two of Apple's latest M4 devices, the Mac Mini and the MacBook. Both packing that impressive M4 chip, these machines are ready to tackle your everyday tasks, but they cater to different needs and workflows. The Mac Mini, a compact powerhouse designed for those seeking desktop performance, and the MacBook, Apple's portable workhorse that embodies freedom and flexibility. Both offer compelling arguments in the ever-evolving landscape of personal computing. In this video, we'll dissect their designs, scrutinize their performance, and weigh the value they offer. By the end, you'll have a clear understanding of which M4 machine reigns supreme, at least for your specific needs. Let's see which one comes out on top. First up, we have the Mac Mini, Apple's unassuming desktop contender. This little box packs a punch. It's been a favorite for its versatility and performance relative to its price. Design-wise, the Mac Mini keeps it clean and minimalist, as you'd expect from Apple. The aluminum unibody chassis is sleek and compact, easily blending into any workspace setup. And don't let its size fool you, it's still rocking a decent selection of ports on the back so you've got plenty of connectivity options, but the real star of the show here is the M4 ch this thing absolutely flies through everyday tasks, whether you're browsing with a gazillion tabs open, editing photos, or even dabbling in some light video editing, the M4 handles it all without breaking a sweat. It's seriously impressive how much power Apple has squeezed into this small form factor. Now let's talk price. The Mac Mini starts at a very competitive price point, making it one of the most affordable ways to get your hands on Apple's M4 architecture. That's a huge selling point, especially for students, creatives on a budget, or anyone who wants a capable machine without breaking the bank. However, there are a couple of things to consider. Remember, you're responsible for bringing your own peripherals, keyboard, mouse, and most importantly, a monitor. This can add to the overall cost, so factor that in when comparing it to the all-in-one nature of a laptop. Overall, the Mac Mini is a beast in a small package, offering incredible performance and value. If you're looking for a powerful desktop experience and don't mind the BYOD, bring your own display approach, the Mac Mini is definitely worth considering. Now let's shift gears to the MacBook, Apple's poster child for portable productivity. This sleek machine has always been a favorite for its combination of design, performance, and that signature Apple ecosystem experience. The design language of the MacBook is iconic at this point, the thin and light aluminum chassis, the satisfying click of the trackpad, and that gorgeous retina display, it's classic Apple, and it still holds up incredibly well. Plus, the portability factor is unmatched. Whether you're working from a coffee shop, catching up on emails during a commute, or just moving between rooms, the MacBook effortlessly goes wherever you go. Under the hood, we've got the same M4 chip that powers the Mac Mini, and as you might expect, it delivers the same blistering performance in this form factor. Everyday tasks feel buttery smooth, and even more demanding applications like video editing and graphic design are handled with surprising efficiency. The battery life on this thing is also insane. We're talking about all-day battery life, allowing you to leave your charger behind and work remotely without constantly hunting for an outlet. It's a game-changer for productivity on the go. Of course, all this technology and portability come at a price, the MacBook, while offering incredible value, comes in at a higher price point than the Mac Mini. It's the price you pay for that premium design, portability, and the convenience of an all-in-one package. So, is the MacBook worth the premium? If you value portability, battery life, and that seamless Apple ecosystem experience, then absolutely. It's a fantastic machine that excels in so many areas. However, if you're more of a stationary user and prioritize raw power and value, the Mac Mini might be the more sensible choice. Ultimately, the best device for you depends on your individual needs and how you plan to use it. So there you have it. The Mac Mini and the MacBook, two fantastic machines both powered by Apple's impressive M4 chip. Each offers a unique set of strengths and caters to different needs and workflows. The Mac Mini is a desktop powerhouse that delivers incredible performance and value in a compact package. The MacBook, on the other hand, is the epitome of portability and style, offering a seamless blend of power and convenience. Which one do you think is the winner? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more tech reviews and comparisons.
Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.